What's going on guys and welcome back to Hearthstone. I now have a new webcam, as you can play as well see. I mean, I can't really direct towards it because I'm in the webcam. So, anyway, I promised to bring you a, a uh, quest. So, Hunter or Mage Victory or Druid or Rogue. Now, I'm not very good at Rogue, but I am good at Hunter and Mage. And I'm very, a uh, little, not really. I'm kind of get a druid. So, let's get into it. I have a new mage deck that I've just built. I mean, literally just built. I tried to record it, but for some reason my recording software kept freezing. Uh, let's see. Magical deck. There we go. Let's get into it right away, shall we? With these two victories, I'll be able to bring you guys some new, uh, a new arena. Now, I'm not going to be doing Naxmas until I get the money up to actually buy the whole set. Because it takes like 700 gold each, and I'd have to complete a lot of quests in order to do that. Uh, it currently probably only costs $15 for me since I've got the Arachnid Quarter and the uh, Play Quarter open, so. Uh, oh, it's found us an opponent. Let's just try to load us in. <laughs> yeah, give me the worst player. Yeah, right. Probably a bot. Breath bless. Okay, this is actually pretty good. We have an arcane missiles and a mana worm. We'll take back the lower of the arena. And we get another novice engineer. Perfect. Okay, this is what we'll do. Turn, we'll, we'll coin out mana worm and arcane missiles. Oh wow, that's a little aggressive, that's kind of scary. 3-2 uh, on turn 1. Okay, this is what I'll do. Summon Mana Worm. Then coin out Arcane Missiles. 1, 2, 3. And then greet him. Hello. Enter. End turn. I don't want to attack with him. Why, why are you saying that I want to attack with him? My cursor was nowhere near him. I could have just, you know, thrown out the arcane missiles and then used the mana worm, but it didn't matter either way. It would have died. Alright, now, uh, Violet Teacher is a very good card in a mage deck because you want to be casting spells. Also good in a druid deck. We will summon an Arubian Egg. Now the reason for the new ruby and egg is because I actually have things to set it off, like my flame, like my fire blast here. My hero power deals one damage. It doesn't say to who or to what, so I can technically do one damage to my ruby and egg over two turns. Let's see what he's got. He's throwing something out. A flame imp. Yeah, as a as a warlock, health is a resource, so. Okay, we'll throw a duplicate. Now if he tries to destroy the Nerubian egg, I'll get two copies of the Nerubian egg, giving me three Nerubian eggs to use. Okay, he doesn't want to destroy it, that's... that's good. It says, when a friendly minion dies, put two copies of it in your hand. I can trigger this either way. Even if he silences that, I can still use it. You'd have to have, like, Flare or something. I think that's the only one that actually destroys secrets. Get rid of the tiger that's peeking out there. Okay, he's draining life. He's trying to gain back life that he's that he's lost so far. That's good. It proves this guy's no fool, at least. That's a good thing. Okay, and he's using Voodoo Doctor to heal himself. That's, that's excellent. Okay, Flame Strike. That'll be good later on. Uh... I'll throw out a novice engineer. There's another flame strike, okay. We will deal one damage to the voodoo doctor. We don't want to take five damage next turn. Also, if we destroy the novice engineer, I'll have two novice engineers, two more novice engineers. Okay. Excellent. Secret. Duplicate. Now I can draw three cards. 
on turn six. That's awesome. Have a little army of one one novice Why? engineers. <laughs> Yes, you do. <laughs> do I have to? I I've heard that so often. It's not even funny. Oh. Alright. What we will do is throw out the Violet Teacher. And then use the Arcane Missiles. Okay, did one damage all across the board. Bad. Not bad at all. End turn. Next turn we can get rid of the flame imp. Probably should have anyway, but oh well. Kinda wish the arcane missiles would have gotten rid of it. Then we'll start trying to get under Ruby and Egg. Now that's the problem. That's the problem with this is that you wanna, you know, try to get try to get your Ruby and Egg out and uh, get rid of it as soon as possible. I decided to bring you a webcam this time. I mean, uh, the webcam will be a little behind, but I mean, I, my recording so my uh, computer isn't very good for the recording software. Uh, oh crap, my pilot teacher's about to die. That's unfortunate. Oh, Dread Infernal. Oh, that's no good. That's not good at all. Ouch. Uh, I'll throw out a novice engineer. Okay, they got me a water elemental. Which I can throw out. Let's go for the face. If he throws out another Dread Infernal, I'll have a 4-4 four, four Nerubian, so... He's gonna need to. He's gonna want to be careful about that. He's gonna want to go for my face or the water elemental. Not sure if that was the best play. Oh, now I have a full Nerubian. Now, yes, he got rid of everything on my field with that play, but oh, what's he gonna do? I don't think he can do anything. He's only got one mana left. Thought so. Okay, now I can do flame strike. Or I can throw out Sledge Belcher. Sledge Belcher, I mean. And then throw out a Novice Engineer. Okay, that's two Lord of the Arenas. That's good. I can throw out those later. Go for the face. Now, as you can see, the Dread Infernal has not unfrozen. That means that he can't use it this turn. He'll only hit, be able to attack with that. The thing is, is it unfreezes during his during uh, the turn after, I guess? I don't know. I, I think this might be a bug. Uh, I thought if he attacked it, it would have unfreeze the next turn, so... That was actually a very big error on his part if, that, if this wasn't a bug, so... I'm not sure. Yeah, you can Shadow Bolt, no problem. Another, I got another Nerubian Egg in this deck. Okay. Now I'll Flame Strike after this. Oh yeah, I'm Flame Striking. He's trying to draw something. Hmm? Corruption. Start of my turn, destroy it. Okay. At the start of his turn. Sorry. I'm too used to that. Okay, we'll throw out a flame strike. Oh, sure. That's why you wait. That's why you wait to use cards like Flame Strike, because it can be so much more worth later on. Now if he's got nine mana, he can throw out something nice and big. I am the blade. Oh, the priestess of the loon. Okay, he healed four damage. That's, that's a little dangerous for me. Soul fire! Oh, I really wouldn't have done that, but... Oh, really? Succubus? Oh. Maybe this guy doesn't know what he's doing. Succubus is a horrible card. 
It's a 4-3 for 2, but that random discard is just too risky. Uh, I'll summon the Lord of the Arena. Go for his face with my power, with my Fire Blast, and then go for his face with my Office Engineer. Now he's going to be top decking this whole time. Unless he decides to use his uh, Life Tap, which he really shouldn't at this point. Okay, now we can use it. Okay, I'll go for my face with that. Okay, now I'm at 10 mana. Okay, I'm a Lord of the Arena. Sources Apprentice. Go for the face twice. End turn. This is this is a close game. This is a very close game. He could easily turn this around on me. This is not good at all. I am oh, Priestess of Loon again. Oh, back up to eleven. This is putting me into a roundabout circle. But fortunately, you can only have two Priestess of Loon unless you're in arena. Let's get rid of this ruby on the eyes. Disturbing me. It, what's your demon fire? Yeah, I'd do that too. After all, my flame strike would have cost one less. He'd have to swing twice to get rid of my Lord of the Arena. Okay, he's hoping to draw something to get rid of it. So what we'll do... I mean, this might be a little mean, but... I'll throw a Sludge, bel sludge Belcher. And Tazdingo. And then turn. He died. Yeah. Okay, I'm at level 17. At level 20, I get an arcane intellect. I have one already. Please don't freeze. There we go. Let's see my uh, recording software froze again. That was unfortunate. Now we'll play Magical Deck again. Let's try. Let's win this one as well. Or hopefully win it. Uh, my recording software is freezing quite often, it seems. It's become rather unreliable, I guess, but. I mean, it's all I got. Another Gul'dan. Dusex. I think I played this guy before. Oh, both polymorphs. No, 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 no. That won't, that won't be good. Send them both back. A flame strike and a shield. Sanji and shield master. Okay. I usually call it Tazdingo, but I recently learned Tazdingo was a uh, hero among the trolls, so. Oh, Pyroblast, that's good. We can end something. We can end this with something. We'll throw out our coin. And then throw out the novice engineer. And we'll say greetings. End turn. Hmm, at least he knows how to greet. That's nice. That last guy didn't greet us. Let's see what he's got. I'm curious. I'm curious to see how these people play their decks, you know? Uh. Hold on a second. I got someone who, here who could possibly help me with this. Come here. My kitty. Hello, Cosmo. What do you think I should do? Hmm? Look at the cards. What do you think I should do? Hmm? Yeah, I think so too. Okay, we'll throw out. We'll throw out the Sorcerer's Apprentice. And then turn. Uh, if I had two of them, it'd be a lot easier. But I mean, throw this out on turn eight. This guy, that this guy, want to get rid of those two real quick. 
course, throw this out on turn two. They really want to get rid of it. And then, of course, flame strike on turn four. Oh, that's a natural combo that I do. And I've heard it's not a very good combo either. He's gonna wish he want he uh he's gonna wish that he got rid of the he got rid of her really quickly. Hmm. Yeah. End turn. He's probably going to get rid of it real soon. He can get rid of it easily. Yeah. Is he going to life? Is he going to uh, drain life it? It's not that light. Okay, it doesn't have charge. Either of those have charge. Come on, let me throw it out. Send you the shield master. This this does not want me to throw cards out at all. And my recording software is freezing again. I don't know why. Uh, let's swing for the face. Let's see. Yeah, let's see here. Let's see what he's got. I'm very curious to see what these people do. The the uh, blood imp and the and the uh, oh wow void terror oh that's that's not good it's a very good card but it's not good not good for me anyway. If he had a, if he had two dragon friends out, that'd be a dangerous combination right there. This guy's been playing for a while, and that's scary. It really is. I'll answer him with a polymorph. Go for the face, twice. See, not swinging for his uh, Scarlet Crusader makes him makes me answer him. That, that's what he wants me to do, and I'm not going to. I want him to answer me. I put a hole in the clock tower again. Oh no! Okay, yeah, he's focused around healing his guy so that he can do stuff more often. Okay, he popped the bubble. Next turn I can just throw out this in my uh, Lord of the Arena. Duplicate! That has potential. Let's throw out the Lord of the Arena. Go for the face. And turn. See, not getting rid of this thing is really hurting him right now, because I keep going for his face a lot. We could flame strike next turn. Okay, what you what are you gonna do? Okay, you gonna do that? All right. You gonna get rid of this with this? No, you're gonna go for my face. All right, go for my face all you want. I need to flame strike next turn because after that, because if I don't fl flame strike within the next two turns, the Scarlet Crusaders out of flame strike range. Oh, not good. Yeah, I need to do it now or else it'll be out of flame strike range. That had to be done. That just had to be done. I wasn't going to allow that Crusader to get too high. If its health got too high, it could have been a real danger to me. Even though I have my Boulder Fist Ogre, which could get rid of anything really big. Because he is really big as well. Oh shit, Sunwalker. No! That 
It's not good. I can't. F I can't go for his face. Okay, you might want to stop doing that. Soul fire. Oh, you're really chancing it, aren't you? Oh, that was sour. Okay, we'll throw out. We'll throw out Sludge Belcher. Pop the bubble. Then Arcane Missiles. Oh! Ouch! I cannot tell you how low the possibility was for that! Dude, if you've got an Iron Beak Owl or a, or a, spell, or a spell Breaker, you're gonna want to use him. Oh, damn! I knew that was gonna happen! I am just too good! Now, if I can throw out a duplicate, I'll have a lot of Sludge Belchers to use. Oh, he plans on using something. No, he just planned on beefing up the Frost Wolf Warlord. Okay. Okay, that's too funny. We'll throw out a duplicate. Throw out a duplicate. There we go. Okay, we got duplicate out now. This is what we're going to do. Next turn, we win, unless he heals himself. Next turn, we just win. That, that, that's, that's all there is to it. So what we'll do is I'll throw out another Sludge Belcher. You're excused. He's a very polite Sludge Belcher. That's pretty nice. Anyway... He's a very polite sludge belcher. Now, if he's got another one of these things, he deserves to win. Oh, he plans on killing things. Oh, that's not good. When you plan on killing things, that's never good. He still has to go for this three times. Unless he decides to go for it once with that. Okay. Draw a card. Draw a card. He obviously didn't get what he wanted. Or did he? Yeah, he did. Oh, really? Just really... He's gonna have to swing at me with that. He should. That that's There's no reason he shouldn't. Unless he plans on using a Voodoo Doctor to heal himself again. No. Demon Fire. That still procs my secret, dude. We'll say sorry. Okay, he went from my face. Okay, we'll give him a well played. Well played. Go for his face with Pyroblast. I have a feeling I've played this guy before. And those are our two mage for the game to catch. Let's wait for the recording software to catch up. Recording software. Hello? Recording software is not catching up for some reason. That's not good. Uh, anyway, if you guys can hear me, I will see you in the next video. Oh, okay, there we go. There we go. Now, those were our two victories of Hunter and Mage. As you can see, it's gone now. Now, next video, I will bring you a Druid run. A very good Druid run. Now, I will see you in the next video. Bye, everyone.